Welcome back to another episode of your favorite Pokemon to AC. So today we have this small comment here. Okay, so I have to make Charizard. Now the first thing I do want to do is give him weapons. So the first weapon I want to address here is this here, because I want to go for attack heat, and I'm not talking about a flamethrower. I want to go for a weapon that makes uh, it's very hard to, uh, you know, stay cool for. The Fenrir would be nice, but I'm not gonna go for that yet. Hmm. Okay, hang on. Would this work? And what is the attack heat of here? That's pretty high. He hot. Uh, no, not Fenrir, not Litsen, not Orc, not a blade. I'm not gonna go blading. Uh, Jesus. Okay, that would be heavy, but I think I can work with that. Just give me a moment to think of uh, how to work this out. Of course, I'm going to go for the Vulture too. I think. Um, let's see. Uh, I'll think about these uh, in a bit. I don't know about an extension just yet. I don't know about... My, I think I can stick to radar there. Um, let's see. Turn these off and... Um, Charizard, huh? Um, let's think for a moment, because Charles, well, what if, what if I just go for, um, the Pegasus here, and try to make this somehow work by go keep, keep choosing, uh, cool parts, so let's see, if I go for a head, that would be cool. Uh, what it will be a charge already head? I think the sting will be a charge already head, but let's just look around a bit here. Actually, wait, this one could be a charge already head. It even got two little uh, antennae on the back, which sort of reminds me of Charizard. So yes, going with that one. Uh, now then, let's go for like uh, the reason I'm choosing cool is not because Charizard is a cool co uh, Pokemon, but well, with all the heat generation, it needs to keep itself cool. So. Well, I think I'm gonna go for a decently heavyweight one. So there's this chest then, and what is a good, uh, cool uh, little arm as well? Hmm. Well, the fence would be not that bad. Okay, you know what? There. And then what are some nice, cool legs that are also decently heavyweight? Well, I'm not gonna go for a tank. I already know that he wanted me to go for bipedals. Damn! With this, I'm still overweight even. Well, how much? Oh, not that much. Okay, okay. Jekyll 2 in that case. I think I have chosen... No, okay. Hang on, hang on. I'll be right back. Sorry my phone started ringing out of nowhere. But okay, okay. Uh, let's go for a generator that doesn't have the highest calorific value. And I think that the Fudo would work well. But I get a lot of decently uh, heavy from this. Same with this one. Let's see if I can even do that. Damn, okay, okay, okay. So let's just see, can I work with this? Oh, it's already got max lag weight. Okay, I need to rethink my uh, strategy here a bit then. So if I go back to the Ananda, how much weight do I lose? Ooh, holy hell, that's a big chunk. Uh, I guess for this one, hang on. Now the G91 stays the best for this M. Okay, what if I... Uh, I don't know, I don't want to work too much with these but Oh, hang on. Ah, alright, okay, okay, okay. Oh, hang on. Okay, keep with the cooling. Keep with the cooling here. There, and more cooling. Jesus, okay, uh... This is gonna be quite an AC, if you ask me. Okay, okay. Then we go for, uh... Some defense. Jesus, look at the defenses there! Um, generator and that, and of course, cooling as well. VCCM is not as important, right? Nah, not really. Uh, I'll go for stability in that case. Oh my god, like, uh, I want to test this out quickly first. Okay, let's see how this goes. Oh, I'm not fast at all. I'm. 
I don't think those back uh, boosters are really helping. I was thinking of doing that so I could color it green, since, you know, the inside of Charizard's uh, wings are green, but I don't think this is helping in the slightest. I think it's just going against it. Okay, I got myself a little uh, bazooka and a grenade rifle here, so I should be heating up the enemy pretty nicely. But, well, <laughs> I, I think I have second thoughts about this uh, back booster. I don't think it's going to be helping in the slightest. And, well, it's a shame I won't be coloring the... Well, I got another idea. Give me a moment. Eleven hundred weight and four hundred ninety-five energy drain. Huh, how about... Uh... <laughs> I got an idea, and then I go there, and those are my wings then, and I can also tune my head to get rid of the weight and get more cooling. Now, is that better? Hang on. I mean, my mobility is still rank D. I mean, it is a heavyweight one, but I think this can work. I <laughs> Yeah, you know what? Let's just go for that. I'm gonna g give it a name now. Hang on. That is gonna be... Char-i-zard. And now I shall quickly go off screen to call it as appropriately as I can. See you guys in a bit. So here we have the AC Charizard. It's gonna be a heavyweight that uh, shoots lots of bazooka stuff. And you got two little wings there, the green ones. And <laughs> all right, I think that could work decently. I want to test against the test AC quickly first. All right, then I'm super bulky and I can't move around that much. But let me just see if I can possibly overheat him heavily. Well, um... Okay, I'm not hitting him too much, but the, the bits that I do hit him, I feel like I'm overheating him there. Bam! And... Oh my god, load! Yeah, he was smoking. Okay. I think the heat is nice. Yeah, I, let's just see how it goes against an actual AC in the arena. Okay, I think I'm gonna go for Moonlight here, because I'm a heavyweight and he's a heavyweight. Let's just see how a heavyweight versus a heavyweight is gonna f uh, fare. Alright, you tank. Let's see if you can stand up against Charizard. Oh, whoa, oh, he's overboosting. Well, doesn't matter. Let's just see if I can overheat him. Well, on the bottom right, I can see some heat. Oh, boy, he's caused some heat with me as well. But I'm actually causing some heat to him, and he's a tank. There we go. My god! Oh my god! Wow! Oh, his health was lead there for a second, if you noticed. Jesus! Charizard, you destroyed him! What the hell? You know, the funny part is, this is exactly the sort of way that I would have made an AC back when I was a kid. Just make it as bulky as possible and just shoot, uh, put grenades and bazookas on it and it will work. And well, I guess this is a bit of a blast to the past, but I think this uh, worked decently as a Charizard because I think a Charizard's a bit bulky. Well, okay, not defensively in the Pokemon game, but he's like wide and does the high fire damage so yeah i think that this works decently i also like the little two antennae on the back there that are like the horns but okay okay i do hope that everybody enjoyed watching this and i shall see you guys in the next episode